us after free tree. No, he wouldn't. Maybe we should hurry up. <laughs> oh, that was close right there. Oh, sh oh, that's rocket. Okay. the architect from the Death Star. I am not <laughs> familiar with that installation. We should probably split up. It's like the Flarkin Collectors Museum all over all right, again. No bad, no bad. Nope. Nope, don't do spider snakes or weird tentacle things. <laughs> Didn't you sleep with a weird tentacle thing? It's like a snot monster covered in pimples. Sounds like a teenager. Jeez, what sort of creature is bad enough that even Hellbender keeps it in the cage? Oh, what is that smell? It's the mulcha. The what? The dry grass. Or at least it's supposed to be dry. Yeah, maybe don't leave it out when you've got a hole in your ceiling. Soy here. Huh. Interesting. I got him first. Oh shit. This is he found a tangerine and Gomorrah has something to interest to say about it in the back of the Milano. Definitely not a fan of whatever this is. <laughs> yuck. Just yuck. Oh, what the heck is that? Looks like a rhino slept with a jellyfish. Creatures than this. Did you not see the skylight? It looks like there's tons more floors like this below us. All right, Gru, we got you. Gru, easy there, bud. I'll get you out of the flat. Whoa, hey, let's not turn him into kindling. Stand back. The it's too thick. Yeah. Damn. It's too thick. <laughs> That's it. Just like the Arago drop, bud. On three, two. The oh, or that. Oh, that dashed witch scripted you down to your bark. You know, we had to show it up sooner. Uh, Good to have you back, Root. Now all we need is an exit. I guess Groot knows the way. Oh shit, they do something to him? Hey, wait up, bud. Wait, 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 What's going on? Uh, I'm gonna go right here. I like this one for you. Say something. You okay, Groot? Shut it, Quill. What did I do? You're the one who insisted on this stupid plan. Now that freaking <laughs> monster queen has, I don't know. Traumatized him. Exactly. Is that it, big guy? Are you hurt? 
Perhaps the tree has been bewitched. She did do something mm, to that Possibly. No, no one's gonna talk about the fact that he's walking around naked. Would you all shut your flock and traps and let me think? Hey, come on, talk to me, man. Oh shit. Do it oh, oh shit. Guardians of the galaxy. You fools thought you could cheat me and suffer no Ah, oh, shit. Groot. Oh, shit, that shit transforms? Which one of you thought it wise to entrust your absurd scheme to a Flora Colossus? You call him friend. Yet you ignore his very nature, overlooking the fact that he is the worst liar in history. I told you, he can't just pretend to be monstrous. <laughs> to his credit, he kept your secret for almost an hour. Lady Hellbender, <laughs> let us settle this honorably. I will face you in combat. Honorably. <laughs> Your offer is worthless, Destroyer. There is no escaping my wrath! Mm. I can work with that. Dweller! Feast upon them! Oh, shit. Oh, my. Dweller in darkness. Oh fuck me. How the fuck am I supposed to do this? That's a true monster. Well, let's make it truly dead. Okay, so maybe this Oh no. Again, how come on, two more legs. Enough toying with them. End this. Oh shit. Don't forget about the big one. And beware the spine of the Don't have to tell me twice. I am trying to destroy. What? No. Make like a tree. Shut him down! Death has come! Alright! We're making progress! Ah, I'm almost starting to enjoy this! Laura! Ooh. You are wounded! We've got to freeze it in its tracks! Let's go! Damn, you got over there fast! Dunzo. What have they done to you? 
Oh. Main body now. Are you gonna fucking start me? I realize how fucking low I was. Okay, good shit, good shit. go squid kicker trophy ooh my good shit Gamora sheesh got that shit I think Rocky got on with us, I think. Who oh, is that that? Oh no. We still need to get out of here and fast. Everybody strap in. That should probably check uh probably that should probably check Groot or unless uh I mean Oh, uh, to check if they put a tracker on him or something. Oh, fudge! Ah, uh, his main boy. Oh, shit. Damn. Ooh. Next time. Your bones are mine, guardians of the galaxy. <laughs> good, good. She will hunt us to the end of the universe. Who gives us Sky? We got off that mud ball with the money, didn't we? Only after the talking tree betrayed us. I am Groot. I do not speak tree. Tree. Hey, you got a problem with Groot, you got a problem with me. Whoa, 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 whoa. One problem at a time. Lady Hellbender will seek her revenge. Mark my words. Then she'll have to get in line. First, I gotta call Corel. The sooner we get this fine paid, the better. Yeah, so we can go back to focusing on being broke. <laughs> Is money all that you think of? 
No, I also think about bombs. And booze. <gasps> bombs made out of booze? Nikki! Did you? I really want to go. There's something wrong with the connection. Did you twist the thingy? Yeah, no dice. Nikki, is your mom around? I really need to talk to her. She's with me. Don't fight me. Huh? After you left, we went to the quarantine zone. I saw the board and the fog. Did you try narrowing the band? First thing I tried, it's gotta be something else. I'm losing you, Nick. Can you put your mom on? I knew you were really bad. I don't know I think something has happened to the girl. Yeah, hmm. it's called she's Novacore. Can you fix it? <sighs> yeah, yeah, keep your star rates on. I'll go check the array. Oh shit. Oh my. The monster frame was that? Complete chapter 4? What the fudge happened? Huh? Do or die. Oh. Ha. Fuck it, relax. It's just an array. Just an array. Look at it, Quill. Where am I gonna get the parts to fix that? It's flarked. I told you it was a mistake to keep that thing. Damn. Listen to me. Oh no, no, no. We don't listen to Rocket. He just has to fix the freaking ship. I promise we'll get it fixed soon. Just like you promised to get your girlfriend to go easy on us? Yeah. Okay. Hey, that's not fair. You know what isn't fair, Quill? Being the only one who actually seems to give a scud about the Milano. Look, guys. We need the doc to fix the array. Luckily, I know a guy I'm nowhere who's got the parts we need. And he can get rid of that Nova track cheap. He cannot abandon the child. Behavior was <laughs> the law the fudge? Shoot the wires tracks is probably just a bad connection. And if we remove the tracker, Corel will make sure the entire Nova Corps fleet is on alert for us. And Moore is right, we made a promise. I made a promise. See if you can pinpoint where Corel is. We pay the fine. Quill, are you freaking kidding me? That way we don't have to keep looking over our shoulders for Nova on the next job. Damn. Sounds like Pilot Mark. Bastard under control. Better not come back and try to finish the can be. Oh, okay. Or else. Tell me, Rodent. Would you have harmed the llama creature if the tree had not removed it? <laughs> Think? That thing's got it coming. I would prefer if you were framed. I would prefer not to have to remove your arm. <laughs> Why do you care about that Larma now? We have removed it from its natural habitat. We must now tend to its needs. <laughs> yeah, as if. I don't think I do any of this now. We did the rocket. Should have been a war crime. Bastards didn't stand a chance. Gamora, I was just admiring this super cool assassin ring I got from my favorite super cool assassin. As a token of my 
You know. Token of what? Of my everlasting commitment to not being murdered by you. It's gonna take more than a ring. <laughs> it is really nice, though. How do you know what kind of ring it is? Oh, let's just say you're not the first assassin to cross my path. Though, I guess I should be glad no one ever sent the deadliest woman in the galaxy after me. You know, that name is actually a misnomer. Everyone thinks I got it doing Thanos' dirty work. Before, you know, I betrayed him. In truth, I got it after I joined the Resistance. On a mission where nobody died. The Resistance mission betraying Thanos. What did cause you to betray Thanos? I mean, he adopted you when you were like... Five. He basically raised us, taught us everything <laughs> we know. So what finally did it? What snapped you out of it? I... found the resistance. What? Thanos was obsessed. He had me and Nebula combing the galaxy for their location for cycles. Each of us determined to be the first to find them and report back. So when I found them first, I was so excited to tell him. I got home, and I found him talking to an empty room. To someone called Lady Death. That's not ominous. I truly thought he loved us. In his own twisted way. But Thanos didn't want to restore balance to the galaxy. He was just in love with death, literally in love. And he would kill all of us, including me, including Nebula, to prove it. <laughs> That's like the real. Isn't that like the real reason, no. like in the comics, so that if Thanos did what he did? I joined it wasn't like to balance the universe and shit. You have to tell me about this resistance mission, especially if no like, one Yeah, died. that's the actual one. I don't think it's a story you're gonna like. Why not? Because it doesn't make Corel look very good. Okay. The thing you have to understand is that it was the end of the war. The resistance was losing. Bad. The Shatari knew it. Thanos knew it. We all knew it. But then, Thanos died. At first, people thought it was a false report. Misinformation spread to lure the Resistance out into the open. But when it became clear that it might be true, Corel saw an opportunity. An all-or-nothing mission that could win the war once and for all. The final attack on Shatari Prime. You're talking about the Resistance stealth mission that kidnapped their infant queen. Except kidnapping the queen wasn't part of Corel's original plan. The only reason she had me tag along was so that I would kill the Queen. What? There's no way. Is <laughs> it so hard to believe? She was grieving. You know that. The Shatari had killed her husband. Her little boy. She wanted revenge, and I was her chance to finally get it. Brel would never put out a hit on a, a, a baby. <laughs> she would never kill a kid. Believe what you want. But she's not who she was back then. None of us are. Something changed. Maybe it was having Nikki. Either way, I refused and we won the war without killing anyone else. And for reasons I don't fully understand, I became known as the deadliest woman in the galaxy afterward. I, uh, <laughs> kind of don't know what to say. There's nothing to say. After the Galactic War ended, I moved on. And now I'm here, doing all this fun stuff with you guys. And I wouldn't have it any other way. But seriously, thank you for sharing that with me. Sure. Okay, just leave me in your room here. Wait, who the f oh, and this is Drax, I think, right? Hmm? Oh, the name's right there, I didn't even see that. Drax, Gomorrah, 
Okay, Star Lord Rocket. <laughs> Anyone in there? Rocket? What? Can't you see I'm busy? Is that my toothbrush? It fits in the uh, small cracks. Oh, Rocket, please! <laughs> Hold it in for a tick. I'm almost done. Oh my god. Penny for your thoughts? What is it, Penny? Uh, it's money. Like units. The saying means I pay to know what you're thinking. We must use our currency to pay the Nova Corps fine, or we risk <laughs> Drax. Just tell me what's up. I am realizing that I do not know as much as I thought I did. Our visit to Seknarf 9 was not what I expected. Because Lady Hellbender isn't a giant? She is definitely not. That is only part of it, Peter Quill. On our way to her fortress, I realized that many of my assumptions about this team have been incorrect as well. Really? The Assassin and the Rodent. Without them and the tree fighting nobly beside us, we would not be alive right now. I told you, they're not <laughs> bad people just because they have a bad past. Life is... complicated, Drax. Things are never simple. But Kataf was. I had a family that I cherished and a certainty about life that I no longer possess. I'm sure you'll find it again. Just give it some time. You are right to be worried about the broken communications array, Rodent. A potential client might contact us and find our messaging system unavailable. Our inbox has been dry for cycle tracks. <laughs> Perhaps because some of us shirk our duty to distribute cards of business. <laughs> yeah, Groot does enough distributing for all of us. Oh yeah, some music. Ah, a fitting musical accompaniment for the situation. I need to put anything. You truly believe the llama creature consumes wiring as its diet? I don't know, maybe? Wouldn't be the strangest thing I've heard. There are numerous Katathian legends about metal-eating beasts, although they usually prefer to consume a warrior's blade, and usually right before an important battle. Convenient. I wonder what the future has in store for us. More fighting! Perhaps next time we should get a contract with no fighting involved. What would you be good for then? Dispatching enemies is not my only skill. Mm -hmm. I knew this one was the one. Guys, doors, come on. Yeah, I wonder if I can upgrade some shit. Make it fast, Quill. I still got that array to repair. Check on them, use bench. Eh. Can we talk for a second? <sighs> yeah, sure. Let's talk. What you said before Seknar about me giving a lot to the team and you making it up to me. You mean it? Every word. Then how come when I tell you how to get out of this easy, you ditch my advice and you roll over for Novacore? 
Rocket, please. Just because I don't always take your advice doesn't mean I don't listen to you. We're a team. Everybody's got an opinion. So, you'd rather listen to Gamora? Gamora? Gamora knows her stuff, man. She's the navigator. She navigates the stars and, and planets and, uh, uh, comets. <laughs> she navigates comets. Sometimes. And Groot is our, uh, special vegetation specialist. His opinion's valid, too. And Drax? What makes him so great? He's, uh... The tactical tactics. The man is such a tactician. And then there's me, the grumpy Flarkhole who does ship repairs. Come on, you're a valued member of this team. We started this together. Now we need to make something profitable of it, something lasting. We could go to nowhere like you suggested, but if we don't pay that fine, Nova Corps will come for us. How do we make money then? Maybe paying our fine makes some sense. Exactly. So let's just get it over with and move on. Right? We'll see. There. Happy now? We done? Do I get no. a raise for this? Maybe. Huh. <laughs> oh, nice. You made a cute little pen. <laughs> You didn't mean to chew up the comms, did you? Looks sturdy enough. You sure it'll be okay in there? I bet Groot has a rich, velvety voice. Array wouldn't be all chewed up if we'd kept the llama in here. Oh, music shit. Mora, did you find <gasps> Are those dolls? Yes. No. <laughs> it doesn't matter. The halosopes in the Teo system. Coordinates are in your console. Huh. So you surprised me, once. Don't get used to it. If you're waiting for me to reopen that page, I won't. <laughs> In the future, I'll try to avoid using the view screen for personal matters. How are Rocket's repairs going? We're gonna need that comma ray fix at some point. So, why'd you close the view screen? None of your business. Isn't it though? <laughs> Sounds like you're trying to hide something from us. Yes, I am. Hate to disappoint, but I saw everything. Didn't really peg you as a doll collector. So what if I collect them? A lot of people have hobbies. Groot <laughs> collects plants. Rocket's obsessed with bombs. Yeah, yeah, and Drax has a lot of really scary looking knives. <laughs> See? Nothing out of the ordinary. I guess. You know, as a kid, I collected stuff too. Baseball cards, action figures. You think collections are childish? No, no, no. Uh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I'm messing with you, Peter. I don't care what you think. I'd just rather keep my hobbies to myself. <laughs> Time's ticking away, Peter. Okay, Corel, get ready to be impressed. Corel is probably monitoring this ship, waiting to see if we make the right choice. 